class, welcome back. My name is Raul Morales, and today we're going to be discussing Fitz and Posner's last stage, the autonomous stage. Here with me, I have uh, Mario, and uh, he's going to be demonstrating the autonomous stage, all the techniques that he was taught, and the proper way to shoot a free throw. Okay? During this stage, Mario doesn't take too much time to wonder where his knees are supposed to be, his footwork, his arm where the basket is supposed to go, okay? He's been fully prepped, he's practiced. Mario, to begin with, we're gonna show the audience here where the, your dominant foot is supposed to be at the line, okay? Feet are supposed to be shoulder width apart, hand placement on the ball, okay? Right there. Dominant hand on top, not dominant hand on the side right there. Your follow through, basically, your hand placement, Okay, elbow, let me see the, the basket right there. The basketball, just where you see it, right above his head, okay? Some coaches recommend that you kind of bounce the ball a little bit, you know, to get the feel of the shot. Okay, you bend your knees a little bit. Okay, Mario's gonna do the demonstration of the autonomous learner, okay? When you're, whenever you're ready, Mario. the wrist follow through bend his knees he didn't think too much about it if you are at the cognitive stage you're too focused on bending your knees or learning about the rules that you don't make the basket basket ends, ends up on, on the stands or something okay no distractions he did it really well and this includes our presentation for Fitz and Posner's model 